Hi there everyone, I'm Dr. QB Ward and I will be your coach and tour director as we make our way through this course of History 1301, or as some may like to call it, History 101. In this course, we will take or take a cursory look at how mankind made it from Asia, actually Russia, to the Western Hemisphere. After crossing the Bering Straits, oh, maybe 25,000 years ago, and that was even before I was born, through Canada, what was to become the United States, then on to Mexico, Central America, and South America. We will also keep in mind that there are various new studies that are showing through DNA research that most likely there were some early arrivals directly from Africa and some parts of Southeastern Asia, even the Southeastern Asian islands. In this semester, how those people arrived to the Western Hemisphere is not the point of this study. But it is good to note the origins of those people who greeted our European ancestors. We will first get started in this course by looking at the people and their contemporaries that Columbus and subsequent Spaniards encountered as they arrived. We in the West owe much of our link of our culture, our language, foods, and science to those who are Native Americans. Then we will, in a bit more detail, study the European colonization of North American continent. We will look at the American culture, our society, the economy, and our strong democratic political system. A primary interest will be our separation from Mother England and the development of our own nation. We will pay attention to the people, to the American people, where we came from and what we did once we arrived, how our nation grew, and the various elements that allowed for the development of our prosperous and strong nation. Industry, immigration, and religion will all be recognized for their part in our development uh, of, our, of our nation. As a darker side of our national development, we will examine the beginning and the use of slaves and the part that slavery played in our national expansion and how slavery was instrumental in the greatest disaster to befall our nation the American Civil War that took over 600,000 American lives. More lives, American lives lost in that war than have been killed in all our major wars together. Hopefully by the time we finish the semester, we will have a better understanding of our significance in our world.